everyone, John here and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about how to use scenes inside of Streamlabs OBS. Now, if you are new to the channel or new to the series, be sure to go ahead and take a look at the playlist or around the channel. If you're enjoying the content, definitely go ahead and subscribe and don't forget to click the bell icon as well. That way you can get notified every time I upload a video. So scenes, very important whenever it comes to actual streaming, because this is what everything is going to be put onto. So the way that I like to describe scenes is like a PowerPoint presentation. So when you're working in PowerPoint, you have slides and the slides are a blank canvas or a blank page or a blank slide. And that's exactly how it is whenever it comes to scenes. So I have two scenes here. And I'm going to go and delete this one just to show you how I created the scene. And it's very simple to do. What you're going to want to do is go over to the plus and it says add a new scene. So we're going to go ahead and you can rename it. I'm going to leave it as new scene and click done. So what it does is if I had stuff populated on here. So I'm just going to go and quickly throw in a game capture. Right. So I'm going to quickly go ahead and throw that in real fast. So now I have something here. I created the new scene. It's blank. There's nothing there because I have no sources added. So the way that I look at sources is the sources are going to be the information that you fill in with the PowerPoint or you fill the slide with. And that's why I like to refer to scenes as PowerPoint slides. So anything that is on this slide here and whenever it's activated, whenever it's highlighted, that's what everyone's going to see. So all the information that you have visible, everything that has the eyeball looking, then everything that's there is going to be shown. Whenever we go to another scene, let's say, for example, I have images, right? So I'm going to go and add an image and we're just going to go and grab one from my desktop. We're just going to grab the halo helmet. So this is here, right? So this is the only thing that's there. I go to the new scene. Let's say this is my I'll be right back screen. So this is what everyone's seeing until I come back and I go back into the main screen here, which is where I'm playing the game. So that is basically how scenes work. Scenes are your slides and then the sources are the information that gets put on those slides. And when the scene is selected, then that is everything that is being presented for people to see. If you have any questions about scenes or anything that I've gone over in this video or any of my previous videos of the series or other series that I've done for streaming and everything like that, definitely let me know in the comments of that video or you can reach out to me in different ways like streaming or through my Discord, through Twitter, through email, whichever way makes it easier for you. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully this was helpful for you and I'll catch you guys in a future live stream or on a future video. Take care.